I'm going to show you how to carve a dragon uh, out of leather and uh, here's the example so first off we need 8 to 9 ounce weight leather uh, 3 quarters of an inch long by 14 inches long what we do is rough up the finished side of the leather. These pieces will be cemented finished side and what you do is fit the finished side to finished side, cement the other side, both sides and then same on the other side and then we end up with a piece like this they all glued together also we've got two pieces of four by four eight to nine ounce weight leather which will be done the same way there'll be the face side will be sanded down a bit roughed up cement the two pieces together these will be for the the arms and the legs of the dragon from that we will draw the the nose of the dragon you can have a short nose or you can have a long nose if you cut at an angle and then you cut towards the eyes And then for the eyes, we just cut a half moon shape. And now we will round out the the nose with the Dremel or the round thing. And that'll give us the eyes and then we have to cut the mouth this will open up the mouth so it's like that then we have to mark the mouth out because we have to take out some of the leather in the mouth here you can see that we've got the mouth out and the top and bottom now we're going to do the fangs and you got to cut these at an angle towards the head same at the bottom scale a bit what we do is we dampen those same with the bottom ones we lift them up and give them a, a twist when you get them to this stage we'll use the, uh, the lighter and we just Help to dry those in that position. It's just to heat off the, the flame, you don't touch the leather. Now we're going to carve the neck. Now we're going to put the scales in for this. So, so here's the scales for the neck, so that can be made flexible. That's done. Now we're going to shape the body down to the tail goes to a point. Okay we got the body shaped down now. Now we have to take one layer of leather off from underneath. Go down take the one layer off and we'll just strip it off. And we'll finish shaping the body a little bit. Now we have to put the scales into the rest of the body. So now we've got the scales cut into the body. We'll dampen the, the tail and shape the tail. As you can see the scales, I'll just try to flex it, get the scales to come up. 
So now we can shape the tail. You can twist it. Okay, we've carved the dragon pretty well, most of it. Uh, okay, I'm going to drill the holes in the nose for the nostrils. And now I'm going to shape the belly a little bit more, round it down the side here. Make up the legs now. Trace a pattern onto a paper and then we'll transfer it onto a 4x4 piece. Here you can see where the, the two arms and the two legs are marked out on the leather. And now we will cut those out. These are stuck on now. Alright, I'm chasing the wings out. So the wings are cut out. Let me cement the wire. To the wings. Okay, I'm gonna cement the eyes in. Now I'm going to drill the holes for the wings. Okay, I'm attaching the wings. We'll cement those in. Now we'll attach the dragon to the base. I did cement the wings in, that's why I, I just pushed them in there for now. That was with a round knife on Wednesday. I didn't put any stitches in it, I just taped it. That's how fast I heal. That's pretty good. You gotta come up with a different project. That's like giving him a yeah. two by four and saying, make me a toothpick. Yeah. <laughs> well, I, th I think the way I'm gonna do it with yeah. that half inch. The half inch ones will be Half fine. inch one and use that. No, 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 no. Don't you get us criticizing. <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm working in four. Four. Oh, yeah, that's supervisor. <laughs> Jimmy, a little bit to the left. <laughs> I'm leaving. <laughs>